Hey guys, welcome back to more Let's Play Dragon Ball Z, the legacy of Goku 2. And in this episode, we are flying. <clears throat> Again. And it's a lot cheaper than flying in real life too. Because it's free. Hey Krillin. Don't mean to alarm you, but I'm taking two energies headed this way. Oh boy. I feel like Frieza. Hmm. That doesn't sound very good. Does that mean Goku failed his mission? Tip of the iceberg. I'm scared. Aren't you afraid, Gohan? No, I'm not afraid because I'm picking up this capsule. Yeah! You found a strength capsule. When you find strength or door to power capsules, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's pretty much like a, uh, excuse me, like a, uh, you know, item that increases your uh, thing. It'll help if I go the right way so I can show it off. Like a strength capsule gives you strength plus one. I'll use it right now just to show it off. So now, my strength is at 11. <clears throat> So yay. Basically, if you ever play Chrono Trigger and you pick up like the power and magic tabs, it's pretty much that same thing. Other games have similar items too. I don't want to talk to you again. Bulma! I came here to see Frieza, but Yamcha's mad at me. Do you realize what Frieza will do when he finds you? Hmm. He has a right to be mad. Or to be mad. Whatever. Yamcha! Talk to me, man. Vegeta's unpredictable. Yeah, no kidding. He was our enemy, and now he's our ally. But Piccolo did the same thing. Well, he's not really our ally right now-ish. I don't know. He exists. Kakarot failed? No, my daddy couldn't fail. Oh. Uh, oh. Oops. I mean, stop it! <laughs> okay, we're gonna go up here and talk to Piccolo, because we have to. To engage in this. Dialogue. Character development. All things that video games must have. Or... Pretty much everything must have. Story, movie, video game, regardless. And now we're going to be at the very... Aw, oh, I wanted to make it to the top. Curse you. Oh, there we go. We're at the top. Yeah! Look how awesome we are. Everybody's all behind us. I saw you I saw you over there sweating, Vegeta. You scared? I think Vegeta's scared. Aw, oh, you thought pictures were funny in this game? Wait till you see Frieza. Oh man, I don't know if it's just the fact that he's destroyed, or I, I don't know, it's just his picture. It's funny. I just find it hilarious. It's because he's got googly eyes above his right eye. I mean, still. I mean, yeah, it looks like Frieza. It looks like him and the sprite and the destroyed Frieza, but... I don't know, I just find it funny. They did a good job with this game, though. I'm not gonna lie. Everything in this game looks really good. And it feels really good to play, except you. Soldiers! Hmm. Oh, hey, we've seen you guys before. Don't make me a Goku out here. Now form into a pattern. Yes, I like that pattern. I like it a lot. King Cold. Cold. Frieza. Cooler. Oh, look at this. It's Boy. Trunks. Not so fast. Now I'm going to destroy you. Hmm. You don't know what you're up against. Well, Frieza, quite frankly... You're about to have a very silly death. Spoiler. <laughs> hey, you should recognize him, Vegeta. Well, never mind. Now, joking around, you two are about to find out what it's like to face a real Super Saiyan. And I'm not talking about Goku. Oh boy. Remember how last video I was talking about Trunks' picture when he's a Super Saiyan? Well, eventually. <laughs> he does kick ass, though. Oh boy. Slice and dice. And there goes Vegeta. Or not Vegeta, Frieza. Frieza! Super Saiyan, I'm impressed. To encounter a fighter like you, or a fighter of your caliber, is a rare occurrence indeed. Oh, not really. You'd be surprised what happens later in the series. Oh my god, he looks like a ram. He looks like a ram. Ah, <laughs> oh, Trunks. Actually, even in the uh, anime, manga, other video games, I'm not really a fan of Trunks. I don't know. I just I don't have really a, a hate against him. I just don't have an opinion on him. He just he exists, like many other people. I'm heading off to a place near here to meet Goku. Would you guys like to come along? Okay. Excuse me. Drinking sodas while playing this and doing commentary equals that. I don't know who he is. Whatever. You guys are useless to me. Except for Krillin. Krillin's a pretty cool guy. He's a Dragon Ball. That Sprite is good Sprite. I like Sprite. Sprite is very good soda. Ugh. 
So, how are you guys doing? It's that same night as I recorded part one. Because I just wanted to play this game some more. And I figured, yeah, why not record it? Just let's do this. And so I'm doing it. <clears throat> Vegeta has no pupils. Yeah, so let's see here. Yesterday I put in a couple gerb applications. Hopefully I forget, or I don't forget one of those. I get one of those gerbs. It would be nice because I has no money and I don't like asking people for money. So I need to work for money. So money! Yay, money! That way I can buy things! Important things, like video game things and food things. Well, food's not really a necess necessity right now. Uh, what other things are there that I need to buy? Really, there's nothing really coming out that I desperately need to be buying. It's just things that I or want to be buying. It's just things that help me out in the uh, long run. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just talking about things to talk. Trying to make an infra- and in, 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 What is Goku wearing? Goku? What are you wearing? You look like one of those people from Little Nemo. On that weird dream world. Which is actually a movie that I kind of like. And I still have it too. In fact, it's upstairs. Little Nemo, come here. I must show you to the people. Sorry about the sex secrecy. Well, I've never had a problem keeping secrets, but sure, you have my word. My name is Trunks. I'm going to. Or if, yeah, I can't read. Of course, I don't really. Uh, my 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 complaints. If I had to make a complaint that I wish they would have changed, is the uh, text box, the little uh, blue lines in there. But that's just like a minor thing. It's I don't know. It's just hard for me to read. Probably not for anyone else though. It's just something I have a problem with. For no reason. They're monsters, Goku. Monsters? What's the deal? Are they aliens? Nope, they're androids. We get to fight an Earth enemy. Dr. Jiro, the mastermind behind the Red Ribbon Army. Ooh, I know him. <clears throat> Look, I'm sorry. Ooh. Mm, yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. I had a bit of uh, a problem. And yet... From what you're saying, these androids are even stronger than you. Sweet. We have a challenge on our hands this time. Yeah, yeah, plot and dialogue. Seriously, guys? Yep, Goku's gonna die by a heart virus! He's gonna have a heart attack! Here you go, take this. It's for your health. There's no cure for the virus, but in my time there is. Aha! He must be from the future! It's purple, too. I bet it's grape-flavored. Nope, it's Trunks' hair-flavored, actually. Your mother knows me? Bulma! You guys have the same hair. Quiet down with her, who you? Yep. I don't remember my dad. Aw, man. Well, cranky guy, that definitely describes Vegeta. Is he also bipolar? Oh, fade to black. How lovely. Goku tells his friends about the warning from the future. I thought it was supposed to be a secret. And so we have three years to train. Well, it's better than last time. Say, Kakarot, why don't you explain how you escaped from Nemec? Or where you got that ridiculous outfit from? Hey, I agree with you, Vegeta. That outfit is kind of ridiculous. Bet Chi-Chi has been frantic waiting for me. Yeah, Dad, let's head home. Let us head home. It's not like we have to train for anything. Of course, it would be nice to say... Excuse me again. It would be nice to say hi to our lovely mother, Chi-Chi. Ooh, is that shrimp? I could go for some shrimp. Oh, mommy, I'm home. I have a surprise for you. Oh, there she is. Well, I went the long way around. Thanks for telling me. Goku, is that really you? Hi, hun. Sorry, I'm late. Guess I couldn't have taken that. Oh, oh you're making a space travel joke. Ugh. <sighs> so lame. I can't be mad at you. I'm just glad you're back. Well, I wish I had that kind of luck. Actually, first, I need to... F Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. We don't need to be talking about that right now. That's for later things. For things whenever I desperately need to find things to talk about things. Which is kind of like right now things. This time, you've gone too far. Well, he was at Namek. That is kind of far away. Fine, you go, but Gohan stays here. I don't want him learning all your bad habits. But we need Gohan for the battle. It's important. Yeah, we need him. He needs to become the most awesome person in the anime until he becomes older. 
I don't want our only son growing up without an education like his father did. Hey, Goku turned out fine. I mean, he knows proper... multiple language, actually, because it is translated and dubbed in multiple languages. Ever thought about that, Chi-Chi? Your husband is multilingual! We'll head to West City next to meet up with Piccolo. Yay, Piccolo! I like Piccolo. Piccolo's cute. Your father is so selfish. I can't believe him. He's selfish because he wants to save the planet? Ugh. Mothers. They'll never... Understand. Why did I go up here? That's not the exit. We Land. Not that it really was in the air. So let us head up to the world map. I think that's where I'm supposed to go. I have no idea what I'm doing. Squirrels! Save. Oh, I fell silent. I could use some, some HP. Some HP. Of course, I probably... I wonder if you can sleep in your bed and heal. I don't know. I'll find some HP eventually. Something over there. Maybe there's a rock over here I can heal off of. Rock! Rock, paper, I could run. Ow. Anything over here? A squirrel. Wee. There's nothing over here. Gah! The area was only important for Frieza. Run, Gohan. Ow. Not into the tree. That was painful. You could have broke it did your nose. I've been here before. Up, 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 up. To the sign, Gohan. The sign. It must be a sign. <laughs> Alright, Gohan. It's about time to fly over to West City and meet up with Piccolo. Sweet. Bum, bum. Journal updated. So, are there any peanuts on this flight? Oh, I can actually pause on the screen. Let's see. Go to West City. Well, that's not very, uh... Con Excuse me again! That's not confusing at all. What am I supposed to do? West City. West. My last name is West. It actually is, too. We're here. Hey, it looks like there's a parade today. Sweet. We get to have some fun. If you find him, could you let me know? Sure. If you get lost, be sure to use the red city map boxes that are posted around the city. Oh, getting lost. You have no idea. Journal updated. Bye, Goku. Oh, look at this guy. Hey, it's Piccolo. Of course, we can't get past you yet because Hercule has to go and be all egotistical. Bet you want my autograph. Well, if it's free, might be able to sell out, or, yeah, yeah, I might be able to sell out on eBay. That'll give me some money. Yay! We got Hercules autograph. Journal updated. Can this parade start already? Yeah, no kidding. Ba bow, bow. Ah, yes. The graham cracker of a bench. So what does my journal say? Get Hercule parade started to gain access to Piccolo. Well, that's the wrong button. That's the right button. Button! What's going on around here? Up! Wow. It's a tall building. Hate to be working in the top floor of that. I'm scared of heights. Hey kid, you want Hercules autograph? Do I? I'll give you this. Did I just accidentally talk to the right person? Holy crap, I did. <laughs> huh. Who would've thunk it? Maybe Dr. Briefs at Capsule Corporation knows more about it. Yeah, there's like... 25 of these things, I think. Give him my high paying executive salary, so I can my husband. Wow. Must be a nice life. <laughs> Must be a nice life. I wish I had one of those. Oh, hi. Wait, that's that kid, isn't it? What the heck? What have I done? Hey, it's Hercule. Wow. Ow. There's a wall there. Pay attention. Ooh, I see another golden. Ow. I see another golden capsule over there. <coughs> Oops. It's a kitty. Well then, I should go this way. Hi, Golden Capsule. Sweet. You found a Golden Capsule. Actually, you know what? I think I actually have the strategy guide book to this in my closet somewhere. Because I did buy the strategy guide to this because it was like... I think it was like 25% off when you bought it with the game. So I figured, why the heck not? Hey, look. You're an enemy! You're an enemy in the last game! Die! Woof. Well... Okay, then. Private residence. Well, I'm just gonna barge my way in here. Don't mind me. How's it going? And then that little puppy's special because you know why? Because he's so special! Really? Yeah. You guys are pointless. Why do you exist? Why do they take time to make you? Oh my gosh, this person needs to cut the grass. 
Private residence. Green. Hey, buddy. You know what's great? Really? Investing in a gate. A gate, you say? Like, a gate of training? So I could go for a gate of training. <coughs> Mar heaven. Boom, 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 boom. Hey, tree. There's Mr. Policeman. Hey, Mr. Policeman. There's a dumpster. Pointless dumpster. I can't interact with you. Ooh, there's a map. Let's take a look at the map of the location. Whoa. What's in here? Is this the antique store you were talking about, lady? Yes, it is. Lessons well, at the park with my wife right now. Yeah. What? Oh. Well, he said something about an autograph, so I guess that's the uh, hint for that. Hmm. You got some pretty weird stuff in here, dude. Uh. Hmm. Nothing to interact with. I see a dog statue. Okay. Thanks for uh, existing, I guess. It was fun while it lasted. I saw the kitty. I didn't get to talk to the kitty though. I am back here again. Well, hmm. Yeah. I think that's going to do it for this episode of Let's Play Dragon Ball Z, the legacy of Goku 2. Next time we will work with this parade stuff. And, hi lady. I want to get in your son's way, if you don't mind. Yeah! See you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.